Kellyanne Conway flat out lies to defend Trump's racist attack. After Trump received massive criticism for calling immigrants animals, aide Kellyanne Conway tried to clean up the mess by demanding an apology from Americans who correctly called out his bigotry. Trump aide Kellyanne Conway wants Americans to ignore what their eyes and ears tell them about Trump's bigotry and instead apologize to him for condemning his venomous comments. Reacting to the widespread condemnation of Trump's remark that immigrants are animals, Conway took to Twitter and wrote, others who rushed to judgment to get the president rather than to get the story o at POTUS, and the grieving loved ones who have lost family members to gang violence, an apology. As part of her tweet, Conway referenced a transcript of Trump's remarks posted by CNN host Jake Tapper, in the apparent belief that the document somehow negates the harsh quality of what Trump said. Rather than condemn Trump's bigotry or apologize for his characterization of migrant families, conservatives like Conway are acting as if his remark was about the MS-13 gang. But the transcript Conway is leaning on, which is also posted on the White House website, makes clear that Trump is referring to people coming into the country. Conway also appears to want the public to believe that the characterization of Trump's comments comes out of nowhere, as if he doesn't have a long and considerable record of bigoted remarks. RNC chairwoman Ronna McDaniel echoed Conway's desperate spin and claimed the media maliciously took a statement from the president out of context. She said the press would rather come to the rescue of MS-13 gang members than report the facts. Trump began his campaign for the presidency referring to Mexicans as rapists. Both on the campaign trail and in the presidency, he has repeatedly made bigoted remarks about many non-white groups. In one instance, he referred to the countries of origin for non-white immigrants as shitholes. This isn't even the first time he called immigrants animals. At one of his self-aggrandizing campaign rallies last year, he referred to immigrants as animals who slice and dice young girls. Trump infamously referred to Nazis as very fine people, but now Conway and others want Americans to think that those calling his rhetoric hateful just came up with something out of nowhere. Conway is aware that Trump was caught on video being racist again. And as usual she resorted to lies designed as alternative facts to make up excuses for his out-of-bounds behavior. The entire country, and the world, can see through the falsehoods and spin.